Brody Fredericks and today we are going to do another golf ball review and we are testing another one of the trust balls. Last time we did the Aurora, which is their pro ball. Today we're doing the Bison Soft. Now the Bison Soft is designed for swing speeds under 95 miles an hour, which is perfect for me because I'm at about 88 to 92, somewhere around there. So I'm really interested to see how this goes. Designed for us amateurs with a urethane cover, triple layered ball, and it's still got that blue, which I liked about the Aurora, but not as blue, still got a bit of sparkles, which yes, there's gotta be mixed feelings about, but I actually don't mind it. I think it's pretty cool. But let's go over drive, chip, and putt, and see how they go. did some driving, there'd be two things I'd love by, uh, trust to do. Make the direction line bigger, so that's like my one criticism. Um, actually, it's only one. <laughs> just wish that line was a little bigger, it's, a, it's very, very small, so trust if you're listening, just make that a little bit bigger for me please. But I do love the sparkles because it makes it really easy to see when you hit it in the rough, and that's something I do an awful, awful lot. Now we're up at the balls and what I've discovered is the trust actually travels really, really straight. I've been playing it now, it's the second round I play the ball and the urethane, <laughs> urethanian, now I can't even remember how to say it, <laughs> actually really does help it stay straight. And then it came out like a bullet uh, and I've actually just tried to really hook one just then and it didn't work at all. So it is a straight ball and a really long lasting durable ball. Distance wise, we've got 218 on the Trust and 229 on the TaylorMade Distance Plus. So that's pretty close. There is a definite difference in terms of uh, compression, I reckon. We know the TaylorMade 60, it is, fine to, it is hard to find the exact number on the Trust balls, um, but I would say easily over 70, maybe even 80. So, yeah, let's see how they spin though. All right, 72 meters. Going tailor made, then the trust. We've got just down to the balls. What we discovered, the tailor made. Now the greens today here at Nianga are really, really firm. And you can see by even me hitting it back there, the grass is really firm. So I couldn't take a huge divot. Um, not that I'd know what to do with it anyway. <laughs> but essentially, the tailor made rolled out probably two feet. So I'd say about 600 mil. And I expected the truss, because they're urethane cover, they pretty much did just under two feet on both of the balls. One of them finished on a slight uphill and one of them on a downhill. So that's actually, look, I'm pretty, pretty happy with that. I'm just gonna go check this one I whacked, which wasn't on so much of a downhill. Again, it's actually rolled, yeah, it'd be three feet and a downhill. So do they spin well? Yes, they do. They're actually, I'm actually quite impressed by them, to be honest. Yeah, let's have a putt and see what we think. Alright, we're about three metres away. Tell them eight minutes. Yeah, nice. The trust. Oh. So, wee, you can definitely hear the difference. 60 compression on the tailor made, much softer, and they reckon somewhere in the 70, I would say nearly closer to the 80. Maybe it's the urethane cover that's harder. Interesting. Okay, we finished up with the bison, and what do I think? Now, you heard on the putt, or you may not have, when I putted the tailor made distance plus against the bison, soft that is, uh, you could definitely hear a difference. In fact, it sort of sounded like an egg compared to just something nice and 
soft. <laughs> um, now, do I actually not like the ball? No. Now, it's $45, so essentially for 12 you know, what are you looking at? Uh, about $3.60, just under $4. So that's quite expensive for an amateur ball, but it is a good ball. And with the urethane cover, it does have good durability. I'm not gonna say that I love it more than the TaylorMade Distance Plus, which is only $22 for a dozen, but I am gonna say it is a good ball. And I've gotta give a shout out to Trust because even on the Aurora and I sort of bagged it, they still sent me these bison sauce to give a go. So are they worth a go? Absolutely. They're a little bit harder than the Taylor Distance Plus, which for me, I don't love, but you might like a ball over 70 compression. So that's been Mr. Elayda Veloz, Aaron Freddy Fredericks. You guys have a fantastic week and we'll see you again next time. Oh,